Hi everybody, this is the Ricoh MPC 6004 service mode. There's several different ways to pull up this number keypad. From the home screen itself, press on printer, and then here you can access the keypad where you enter the service mode um, digits, which is reset 806182 clear. Or another way to pull up the keypad is simply hit copier, and the keypad pops up here. Reset 806182 clear. Um, I like to go to the left side of the panel. This is the most preferred way, just in case these are not available. It's in department mode or, or some kind of user access mode. Go ahead and remove the left side access panel. And then there's three buttons. This is right next to the SD card and the USB slot. Three buttons here. Go ahead and hold down the first button closest to you and press the check status button on the screen and the number keypad pops up right there so the service mode number is reset 806182 clear button hold the clear button and boom you're in service mode now i like to go into on a service call i always like to keep track of where the drum developers are at the number of counts you got on the fuser unit transfer belts it's a good indication of of um, indicating and monitoring if these components are needing to be changed just in the event you run into image quality issues jamming problems so in this about the fifth one down is PM counter and then counter list printout execute and it will print out It'll print out the PM counter list. Black drum, photoconductor is at 108,000. It's rated for 400K. Um, the cyan, magenta, and yellow is at 53,000. It's rated at 270. And the transfer belts, it's, it's at 108,000. Fuser is at 108. Um, so you can kind of get uh, a quick synopsis of the um, condition of your most most used consumable parts and hopefully when technicians put if you guys util utilize this it'll definitely help the next technician coming out in the field um, to determine if these parts are used up or they're pretty new um, another area i like to go into um, or i find myself going into a lot is the sp mode uh, system sp and if i get a fuser error it's the sp5810 and that's the se reset fusing se reset after you check the thermistor thermal fuses thermocouplers heating elements um, all that checks fine uh, fuser units fine you can go ahead and reset the fuser unit uh, fuser error codes by going into this fc user SC reset um, and another thing I like to go into is in the printer printer SP just to check copy quality or print quality I should say just on the engine itself if we go to service mode and test page 1103 and I print a color pattern execute and It prints out just a, a color pattern um, developed by the um, the engine itself. So a color test pattern here. It shows you the different the different colors, the solid tones that you get. Um, it stretches from the length of the page to the to the width. So if you see any any um, distortion or any white lines going through you know that there's something wrong with each of these colors and it's a good troubleshooting tool to determine what part of the machine needs to be looked at as a field service tech what drum what developer what color what color is indicating that there is a discrepancy 
So that's some tools that you can see that could be quite helpful on the field. So that's the service mode on the MPC 6004.